lovely. Can I get an adjective that starts with the letter T? Timid. Tenacious. Timid. Tenacious. Talkative. Terrible. Terrible. Oh. Terrific. 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 Twisted. Horrid. Titillating. All right, very good. Very good. Thank you. Uh, we are going to go with twisted. And can I get, uh, let's see, you said H. Can I get a noun uh, that starts with the letter H? Hair. Oh, Hair. Oh, Hair. Horse. 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 Hair. Horse. 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 Yeah, keep coming. Hot air. Horcrux. 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 Keep coming. Keep coming. Come on. Come on. Come on. sister's bathroom one night to use her curling iron to keep my hair out of my face instead of hairspray because my hairspray smelled girly. <laughs> so ironically I used my sister's hair product to, to, to curl it up. Um, and it looked like uh, Jim Carrey from Grinch when I was through. <laughs> In addition to that, I burned my forehead. Um, so it, it was, uh, it, my hair was out of my face, though. I'm black. So, <laughs> <laughs> um, I got different hair from some people around me. And it's cool because yeah. I love my hair, and that's why I touch it frequently. And I even twist it because that's how I do what I need to do. But you, on the other hand, cannot touch it. No, you cannot touch it. You cannot pet me. You cannot put your hands in it and fill me up. No. No. I know it's fasting. I know I'm hot. But no. You can't touch my hair. I'm just saying. <laughs> Hello. My name is Johnny. Johnny from Greece. And I love the black woman's hair. I love the black woman's hair. But I love my hair because it's nice and flat. Way we had, way we had. But what I like the most about black women's hair is my fingers get caught in the hair and I just pull and pull and I just love to pull the hair. <laughs> <laughs> that they made at this convention was um, a product for hair's hair. So they didn't want any rabbits, they just wanted hairs. And they had it to where these these rabbits would twist around in these little, you know how gerbils have these little twisting tubes? They'd have them twist around in these things and then they'd come out and these hairs, their their hairs would be twisted, just like, like black ladies' hair. Uh, there's, a, there's a guy running for office. He, uh, his hair straight, but he manages, manages to twist it <laughs> all around his head and to make it look like he has a lot of hair. <laughs> you know, he just has a, a few hairs. <laughs> oh, man. This is a crazy story. You know, I met this girl. We were at a convention for inventions, right? And a uh, black chick, man, beautiful, beautiful. We were walking around, petting rabbits. Everything was going smooth. She said, what are you doing out there? Nobody ever asked me that question. I'm usually the one asking. She said, come over. I come over to a house. We go in the room. Next thing you know, we go on the third base, off gate. So I'm in there. And I'm thinking we can get freaky dick because this is the first night. <laughs> so I grab her hair. And I twist the hair, and she hit my arm down and look at me and say, Bitch, don't touch my hair. <laughs> I'm really sorry. I just, I didn't. You know, it's. it's You're so ignorant. I just. I was sorry. I just didn't know that you didn't want your hair touched. You know, I thought that most people liked it. Sorry. Most people like her. Like most people? Like what? Like who? Like <laughs> <laughs> people with Leave. Okay. I'll call it tomorrow. <laughs> <laughs> Johnny. From Crete. 
That would be. <laughs> you know, I have certain rules, but I think I'll make an exception for you. Please do. Please. <laughs> touch it, she burned a man. Oh yeah, I forgot about that.
don't know what else to do, you know? Mm-hmm. I feel like I'm, I'm, I'm giving her my all. Yeah. You know? Come home, mm-hmm. take out the trash. Yeah. Yeah. I yeah. fucking watch Lifetime. You do. <laughs> Eight to twelve. And you every probably, night. You probably cry too. You know. You don't understand. Do you rub in between her toes that way? All of that. And she be having little sock crumbs right yeah. there. Yeah. <laughs> <laughs> Um, 
You're up. <laughs> oh. <laughs> oh. Oh. I'm around all the time, bothering me. What is it that you want from me? Well, I just wanted to talk. I have a lot of friends, but you're one of them. I'm listening. <laughs> you're listening? Why did you do your hand like that? Because I'm, really I'm letting you talk. You're going to let me talk? Yes. Oh, that's what This is your opportunity. Okay. You are so, in the presence. So one of these days, I went out and I, I saw this bear. Okay. But it was in a, like a, a public place. And okay. so I didn't really understand why there was this bear. And I'm like, okay, if we live in Utah... But, but you know, there's all this desert area okay. around it. Why is this bear here? Oh. And so that was my thought. And so my first thought was like, who is my smartest friend? And I was like, Tony Jacobs is my keep smartest going, friend. Going, so I came going. to see you okay. and I'm like, why is this bear out here? He is not in the right place. He's like, there's no trees. Like, what is he going to eat? Don't they eat honey? And it's like. I mean, he could be eating the trash, because now, like, in urban places, they eat trash. But this was in the middle of Moose, Utah. What the? are you talking about? <laughs> <laughs> and, Keep going, okay. <laughs> <laughs> and he's, like, a population of about 60, and they don't, they don't accumulate that much trash, because they all met each other on Splinter. Like, the, the you know, like, the tender, but it's Splinter, because... They're all tree huggers, so they recycle most things. They don't have much trash. Okay, okay, I think I've got the gist of it. Okay, is that all? Yeah, and and because they don't have much trash, they compost. Okay, all right, and let me show you to the door, and um, <laughs> I'll make sure. So we meet again. Me too. Oh, you don't remember me? Yeah, I remember you. Jane, Janie, we met. Yeah. Jamie, yes. Yes. You know me. I'm Timmy. Timmy? Yeah. Yeah. That, that yes. is, I, I saw you. You're very familiar. I'm trying to, I'm trying to place it. Yeah. We met at the, you know, we were in, 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 in Queens and yes. it was the, the strip club and yes. I was just, I gave you a lap dance. And <laughs> I'm reformed now. I don't. I don't oh, dance I remember your hair. Oh, I love that yeah. hair. My name was Foxy Brown. Oh, so oh that's Shibre. right. Foxy. So I, I had to get. I wore the boots God, and the you know the thong. It's that was the thing of the past. Yeah. I'm reformed. I don't do it anymore. You don't do that anymore. I don't do it anymore unless unless uh, if I do it, it's more expensive. Just in case you were wondering. <laughs> I <don't do> that. <laughs> yeah. What's up, dude? Hello. I mean, you, 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 you came to see me. Uh, we all, we all, um, it says we're open five to nine, so, and I operate this store. Mm hmm You walk through my door. Mm hmm so Technically, you came to see me. Mm hmm Uh, why don't you do us most favor and have a seat? Uh, all right. And, um, I know it's late and everything, we get yeah. Not in your right mind, but, oh, uh. You don't have to touch me, bro. What did you want to eat? I'll take corned beef sandwich, a glass of sweet tea, some okra, some macaroni and cheese, special cheese. That's 50 cents extra. 50 cents. Still want it. 50 cents. You invited me to your place of dining, and you charged me a up talk. Let's see what I just did. There's your order in the wind. Bye bye. I don't see our fruit people. I don't see our fruit people. <laughs> Hell no. I gotta go. <laughs> Hello. 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 Uh, Jamaica, New York, but my girlfriend isn't going to like Jamaica, Jamaica, and I'm oh. so screwed. I, I need to get like a refund. Yeah, like, yeah, I, I don't have the money to go to like like real Jamaica, but now she thinks we're going to Jamaica. It's going to be like, <laughs> like uh, she thinks I'm going to propose, and oh, yeah, I don't she, even have. She's going to kill you. <laughs> <laughs> oh my God. Is there anything you can do for me? Is um, there anything you can do for me, please? Um. 
Please well, tell us I can you. I can give you a ticket refund and then you can take her somewhere else like the aquarium and at least she'll see fish. I think mean. <laughs> <laughs> you eat. Uh, you know what? That might not be a good idea. You think that's a good idea? You think that's a good idea, really? I mean, you can you go to one of those ones that has like a theme, and you can go to like a Jamaica theme one, like at the zoo. You can go to like Australia. Oh, yeah. Africa. Maybe you could go to that is great. Holy shit. Totally I'm just trying to help. Great. It's that my is... job, you know? Oh, God. Thank you. Thank You're you so welcome. much. Thank you. You're so welcome. Good. Good. Honey, that was so sweet of you that even though Jamaica had that hurricane and you couldn't go to Jamaica, there's like all these fish that are from Jamaica here at the aquarium. I really, that is so thoughtful. And you said we could take those bongo drums here and I just really appreciate that. So I just wanted to tell thank you for being so honest. You're welcome. <laughs> Okay, so whenever you're ready. 
Show us what you got. Great, thank you so much. For your time. <laughs> <laughs> I got you the nose too. Perfect. We will give you a call. Thank you. Thank you. Thank you. Next. I was in mine. I was in mine before I had it, so I'm gonna go and do the audition next. So this is my my piece for the play. And I am auditioning for every role that you have available. Um, He's my associate. <laughs> so I don't. The director. Right, so watch. Just go ahead. The director must have. Sure. Okay. Um, once upon a time, I was not so much of a clean, clear woman. I had a mind blocked by sexual thoughts and innuendos, and I was on a pole Man. more frequently than I was. That's good. That's good. It was, it's dramatic. It's a dramatic monologue. I wrote it. That's good. That's good. That's good. But, um. I can finish and it'll be even better. It's, you're good. Just, um, <laughs> the content. There's that one line where I talk about the guy. Stop! Sorry. But it's the best part. <laughs> you know, in every story, there's got to be a climax, and so I added it in to kind of help the story. There is. The director would have liked it. That's no. why I thought I was doing it for him. No, 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 no. Oh, dang it! I should have just auditioned for the rabbit. I could have owned that. I was about to say before your thoughts interrupted. <laughs> 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 You're mine. But I was going to say this is. Foxy Brown. I can be Foxy fucking Brown. I can be her. 
And so, you know, I've been auditioning for plays and I've been, you know, trying to build serious relationships and I've been trying to be what people consider a human being and I'm, I'm failing miserably so far because I just can't commit to one person and so people don't take me seriously. But just know that I'm working on me and sooner or later they're going to really see me as foxy, but in a way that doesn't make me feel less than. So look for my name. Look for that. Yeah.